Hello, greetings from Boonari TV. Today's bizarre news is well of hell. What's that? Is there something truly like a well of hell? If so, where is it? Let's find out. This is a picture of well of Barhaut. It is a sinkhole in Al Mahara, Yemen. It is believed to be millions of years old. It has a circular entrance that measures about 100 feet wide at the surface and its depth is 367 feet. There are many stories about this well. Some people believe that this was the place where wicked people were tortured after death. Some say that their heads would be severed once they're down there. Some even say it is a prison for genies and anyone whoever came close to this well would be sucked into it without any escape. Hence, with such stories making rounds, the locals call it Well of Hell. But recently, a group of cavers took the challenging task of trying to go underneath and explore what's at its bottom. What happened next? Take a look. A group of cavers from Oman, a neighboring country, decided to descend this well. Once they were down there, they were taken aback by what they saw at the bottom. No, there was nothing supernatural, but only a lot of snakes. Why so many snakes? There are no predators to eat them. So, all they do is procreate. The whole group of cavers spent entirely six hours down there. There was a bad odor, which was because of the dead animals or birds. Earlier, people had said that the water of this well is toxic or evil. But the cavers found the water fresh. They drank an entire bottle and nothing happened to them. They also found something very beautiful and precious. What was that? Watch ahead to know more. At the bottom of the well, the cavers found colorful pearls. But we know that pearls are only found underwater in shells, right? But then, how come they found them here in this well? Were these actually precious stones? No, these pearls are actually stones which are smoothed by the movement of water falling for thousands of years until they form beautiful pearl shapes. Finally, the team collected samples of rock, water and soil to conduct their experiments and research and they came up back again all safe and sound. This investigation of theirs had helped people to come out of their superstitious beliefs. <laughs>